The idea was to get a little bit of everything. We want some textile work, we want acrylic paint, traditional oil painting, photography, sculptural qualities. I was really thinking about how we would fill the space so there would be a balance within all the different medias being expressed where it's not any one particular thing or one particular media. I wanted the audience to get a very diverse feel when they walked into the show and at the same time I was hoping for color to really pop so that the sense that color was what we were paying attention to. It's St. Louis and it's winter so at the face value the color is fantastic. People through the years have used color to express hope and to uh, rebel. I think the shows here are always very, very high quality, and so I'm very pleased to be part of the show. It's a photograph that was made in Chile in a town called Valparaiso. During the dictatorship in Chile, it was a place for people to really express their feelings of frustration and rebellion and hope in color. All my fellow participants of all have very distinguished work in very different mediums, and yet the jurors managed to fit it all together, so the, the standard is quite high. In this exhibition, there are artists from all over the country. It's a juried exhibition, which means that artists would submit their work to us, and then Albert had to go through and, and curate it down to the excellent collection we have. An arbitrary color there is a just over 200 submissions that were included. Out of the 200, we chose 37 pieces to include in the show. Well, I mostly focused on time and culture and how we use color today. The subject matter was pretty flexible. Some are very abstract and some are very much to the point of representation. The diversity in the show was chosen so that you know everyone can get a little bit of something to take away from. We're in a world that is exploding in color and it's a very interesting exhibit. We have a very good display of many, many artists here with different kind of motifs and different kind of textures. The Foundry Art Center is located in downtown historic St. Charles and we are here to connect the community with the arts. It's that simple. There's no certain right or wrong way. It's art people, just do whatever you want to do. There are no rules here, but somehow it's all tied together. It's the beauty of it.